what is going on everybody welcome to building cars and slr or whatever the fuck this is called i don't <laughs> i don't remember um today we will be building a nsx now i'm not too sure what the, the the future brings for this car what kind of engines and whatnot i'm gonna do probably in the title because clickbait you know but if you guys want to request any cars for me to build just throw that in the comment i'm not saying that i will choose <laughs> the request because i had two requests from uh, from last time but could not make them at least I, one of them i could make but i'm not too keen on doing that right now but i'm gonna throw a shout out to classy turtle now i've been watching you for a while i love the game okay, keep up the great work thank you my dude thanks for the support but without further ado let's just get into this so first things first you know i would like to remove the suspension i like to put some nice coil over some racing suspension on this car because you know that's always a good option to do what the fuck is this <laughs> oh my god we've got a very big v v6 in there a very very big v6 just sitting there can i even see it no, it's like impossible to see the engine. Oh, well, that's not nice. That's not nice. Okay, this will be a, quite a, quite the interesting. Should I make a front mount? Uh, there's, there's shit in here too. Okay, well, ooh, this is going to be an interesting build. This is going to be an interesting build. I'm not too sure well th where this build is going, but I'm, uh, I think it's going to be special. So we got a greedy type S. Uh, you need to install the Mr. Sir suspension first. Uh, that's Mr. Sir, right? I mean, not, not none of those uh, cheap shit. Yeah, so you got a greedy type S suspension. What the fuck is wrong with the front end? It's not how suspension should be. <laughs> Whatever. We got the 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 the, 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 the same springs, greedy type as creams, but we got something special for the brakes. Three three hundred and eighty millimeter carbon brakes on the front and three hundred and fifty five millimeter carbon brakes on the back. We've got some six piston uh, brakes all uh, six piston uh, calipers all around. So oop. oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Let's install the stock wheels for now. Obviously, and we'll see how things go later. Okay, this might not be good. This might not be good at all. So we've got a problem here. I don't. Why are the why are the springs there? Like, why are they sitting like that? The fuck is this? Did I duplicate the front bumper? Yeah, I duplicated the front bumper. Okay, so car definitely looks nice, except a bit too much camber on the back. Just slamming the car. But this is not good. This is why is it sitting there like that? Hmm. All right, I'm gonna check out options. So. <laughs> One way to fix it is to max out the camber. As you can see, I'm still clicking the negative camber in it, uh, camber in it. But I don't want to do that to the car. I don't want to have a stance. I don't. I, just, I don't think an NSX should have like a uh, fitment like this. Obviously, I'm gonna. I, I would push it out to fill the, the thing. But I don't want. I don't want camber like that. That's not good. We're not in a good situation right now. So this might do for now. You can still see the shock through the through the th through the tires, but I'm gonna keep that as is for now because I, c I can't deal with it right now. You know, it's it's it's. Uh, I'll, I'll, if I need to, I'll change the front suspension. It's not a problem. But let's go on to the next point, which is uh, engine. And what am I going to do with engine though? So the car originally did come with a V6 with a three liter and a three point and a two three point two liter v6 and this is a how big of a v6 is this i'm sorry how much power are we making 283 that's actually pretty close to the original three liter yeah that's, that's this is like essentially the original engine but we don't want that right we want something a bit more powerful should i go a turbo v6 or should i do something crazy i'm not too sure so i've decided uh, uh, you gotta go crazy with these builds this is slrr after all you gotta go crazy and yeah let's let's remove this bad boy and install this bad boy now it looks the same but this this is a v v vr 30 vr 34 det the, the the gtr engine this is a dt gtr engine <laughs> well that doesn't look right that doesn't look I, I was actually hoping for the real engine not this and a quote unquote vr 34 det engine hmm I don't like that. A few things I would need to change. I'm gonna keep using this engine since there is not a lot. There aren't a lot of options for engines, uh, sadly. In this mod uh, link in the description if you want to download this mod. I need to rotate this to 90 degrees though because it's gonna stick out. It doesn't matter that it's not. The, it doesn't matter how realistic this is. But as you can, as you, as you can see, we've got a, a bunch of bunch of intercoolers and whatnot. So I've got a few options of so throwing the intercooler, like removing the removing the the, the the windshield and putting the intercooler like over here. That would be quite ridiculous if you ask me. Or uh, throwing the intercooler out in front, which will also be quite ridiculous if you ask me. Especially since uh, this is a mid-mount car. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let's try and do some wild shit. So we've got two options for these intercoolers. We've got the this one and a Greddy one, which I think the Greddy is much better and much cooler. Can I move though? Oh, I can't move it, dude. That's so that's so stupid. Why would I? Why can I? Why is the car 
bumping up and down. That's not cool. I don't want that to happen. I don't want the gun to be moving. That's not. I really wanted to just move the intercooler front to the front. That's really not cool, though. It's really, really not cool. Uh, even though that's that's not how. <laughs> that's not a good idea. Look where the intercooler is. <laughs> Uh, plus, I really want this car to be very powerful. I've got carbon br the discs on it, dude. What is this? What is this power band? Oh my god, dude, that's not good. We're not doing good. I don't, I don't know. I'm doubting this engine. I'm doubting this engine like a lot. It's a zero point, a 1.5 bar. Will we get a fast car if both turbos are at 1.5 bar? Not really. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not feeling this engine, boys. I'm not feeling this engine at all. Alright, so because of the lack of engine options and the lack of engine modifications, I've decided to go with a stock NSX engine with a supercharger on it, even though it's obviously not the stock NSX engine. It's because the game, the, the mod is not... Uh, I'm slightly disappointed. Uh, but yeah, oh, you can actually see the supercharger over there. Uh, it doesn't matter. So we've got a supercharged NSX making a solid... 50 more horsepower than stock. There we go, boys. Ah, it doesn't. I, I can't. I can't do without. Let's. Uh, let's. Let's go on to the cool parts and actually change how the car looks because we are uh, done with the engine. Oh, that's not nice. Okay. Okay. Well, that was not. That was not good at all. So I'm stuck between a few bumpers. This one just has a, no, a normal lip. This one that has a colored lip and a bit more of a aggressi aggressive lip. Well, I, I think it really suits the car very well. And uh, this one. <laughs> this one is quite special as you can see this one is very very special the problem is I was really wanting to make this car very powerful and this would have been very nice but right now the car just has 80 more horses and uh, 50 more horses than normal and very unfortunate so I'm not too sure which one I will go I'm gonna check out the other parts of the the, the other parts of the body and see where uh, where that leads us to all right I'm very disappointed <laughs> in what options we have what the fuck happened with the suspension oh <laughs> Oh my god, uh, I'm very disappointed with what options we have for this car. So the rear bumper is this. I'm not feeling that at all. And the wings. <laughs> this is one of the wings we can do. This is the other <laughs> wing we can use. And um, this. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I'm not vibing any of those. I'm going to go through stock that, stock that. And uh, this will not fit any of the car. So let's go with this bumper. Ooh, the car does look nice now. Uh, I need to fix the suspension. Something happened with the suspension. I'm not too sure. If I move the car, will it happen? Why is the car not moving? Oh, I didn't click the thing. Well, whatever. Yeah, the suspension seems to be fucked, but that's okay. Uh, well, I guess that's not that does it. For outside look. I don't know. These 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 carbon brakes seem to be out of place on this car right now. So right now I'm debating between two singles and two quads. The shotguns or the uh, uh, traditional traditional JDM exhaust. And I'm not too sure about it. Hmm. Oh, this is a pretty hard uh, decision for me. Like, I like how these look. I like how these look between shotguns. But I also like how these look. And I think it's more, I guess, it's more accurate to have, like, the car came with two singles. Maybe I should continue with two singles. Or maybe I should go with quads. I don't know, quads kind of fit the car a bit better. I'm going to go with quads. I don't know, guys. You, you guys tell me what you, you, you would have preferred to see. I don't know. Nah, but let, let's go and choose some, a, nice, a nice set of wheels on this car. So I'm currently in a very sad position. So these are 18-inch BBS LMs, which kind of look small. And the big problem is I can't adjust their offset. So I need to go do shit through here, uh, which we know is uh, actually everything broke. Oh, I guess I need to restart the game. Oh my god. So if we simply ignore the fucking destruct, this is what we have. We have d deep dish BBS LMs, 19-inch, which obviously kind of look too big. And we've got BBS LMs. 18 inch which kind of look too small i am i am unsure of which to choose boys i am so fucking unsure of which to choose there's just something so fucking brutal about the deep dish lms kind of looks better than than this one because it has this has such a big lip mm. and there are no i mean this is pretty deep dish if you ask me but they're not the same rim like these are just much cooler i'm gonna go with the big 18 inches man i'm also gonna remove the tire dude it's way too much of an exposed lip there oh my god mm. So it seems there's just something wrong with the game itself. Uh, the mod, not the game, but the mod. E every single strut and combination of fucking of, of everything, it just stays like that. It just stays like that. I don't know why, but I think I know a good solution to this. I guess uh, there we go. This is the supercharged Honda NSX build uh, done. I'm not gonna lie. I'm slightly disappointed. 
because there was not a lot of options to mod this car in. I hope for a lot of uh, options, but we don't have too many options, but the car does look nice. The problem is, whenever I tweak the fitment, one side, like you can see this, this side is uh, poking way, way more than this side, because I fix this side, this side goes out. I fix this side, this side goes out. It's, it's something buggy with the game, you know, I, I can't, I can't do anything about that. Um, I mean, at the end of the day, the car does look very nice right now. This side more than the other, because the fitment is better, but... but yeah, um, if you guys want to see any other cars, just hit me up, and uh, we'll, we'll, I'll, I'll, we'll see what we can do. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.